Yeah, so when these articles come out about China banning Bitcoin, you guys gotta know this has happened every single bull market. Every time there's a bull market, China wants to ban Bitcoin and it's all this news. And it's really just fear to get you out. It's called fear, uncertainty, and doubt. A lot of people like us, we do all the homework, we're doing the digging, right? So that fear, uncertainty, and doubt won't phase people like us. But it will phase someone like, let's say if I told my grandma to get into crypto, right? I told my grandma, hey, crypto is a good choice. You should do crypto. She takes my word for it. She invests in it. She sees the mainstream talking about China banning Bitcoin. Who is she going to trust? She probably is going to trust the mainstream media over me. And that's the whole purpose is to get those weak hands that didn't do their own research out. They can't get me out because we know the facts. We know this happens every time. That's why it's important to do the homework, do your own research. Every single time it's the same story, right? China bans cryptocurrency. China bans this. China bans this. Blah, 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 blah. It's all just fake news. People in China probably laugh about this. Soon, all of us will be wage free. XRP is better than gold. 100% XRP is better than gold. A team right now could decide, hey, let's go digging for gold. They could go, it's gonna be difficult. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy, but eventually they could find a gold mine and, and dig for gold. And there's always gonna be some more gold out there, I believe. There's even stories about vast amounts of gold in the Grand Canyon and other places around the world that have been hidden. So there's a lot of gold out there. And, and the one thing is, we don't know how much gold is out there. We know how much XRP is out there. There's only 100 billion XRP, that's it. Once those 100 billion are gone, they're gone. You can't go and mine more XRP. It's finite, that's why it's better than gold. It's more valuable than gold in my opinion because there's more than 100 billion ounces of gold out there. There's only 100 billion XRP which makes it extremely scarce and rare. And because it's so rare, the world needs to put it to use. And because you own it, if you're wise and you don't, and let's say there's a buyback, I feel like a lot of people are gonna settle for the buyback of XRP, but if you're wise and hold all the way through, you're gonna be able to loan your XRP to the internet of value, basically all the money via Flare, while maintaining custody of that asset so you actually stay, you keep ownership of the asset and then you loan it basically via Flare and re earn rewards. We're already seeing the test network Songbird go live. Songbird, I have mine delegated, I have my Songbird uh, delegated, you wrap it, you delegate it to different providers and you're gonna earn rewards for, via Songbird. So easy. I'm getting mass adoption vibes from Flare and Bifrost Wallet. Literally so easy, so simple. Two buttons, I had my my Songbird delegated. And we're gonna be earning rewards from Songbird. We're gonna be earning rewards from uh, via Spark and uh, our XRP. There's so many ways that we're gonna be earning passive interest. I call it aggressive interest because it's not passive. We're gonna have so much coming at us so fast we're going to be wage free. We're going to be able to cut that nine to five living out of the question. We're going to be the new 1%. And a lot of people have been getting confused when I say, hey, selling XRP for, for cash isn't the point of invest. Like, what's my sell target for XRP? You guys aren't getting it. The whole point is once all this, someone's like, well, you could take profits and become debt free. Well, the whole point is, what if you could just pay off your credit card with your XRP and you didn't have to do the extra step of converting your XRP to cash, then paying off your credit card. What we're saying is XRP is going to be a currency that could be used to purchase anything. You could do anything. You could swap it for a home. You could swap it to pay off your credit. You could buy groceries with it if you need it emergency situation you just swap it in and out of whatever it is that you need it's the most uh it's like the matrix it's like the uh the universal key for money you use it for chinese assets anything in the world it interoperates so what we're saying is you won't ever need to do that extra step of cashing out into fiat and then into what you want
you'll just swap from XRP into what you want or XLM into what you want. I have another saying that I want to explain more. I want to go deeper into XDC brings the ecstasy. You got to watch out for alligators and stuff out here. It's different. You don't got wildlife where I'm from. But um, XCC brings the XCC. I, I, I don't know if I'm the first to say it, but I, I've been saying that a lot. So what does that mean? XCC brings serotonin. It brings the rush. But usually it only lasts a few hours. Go to a rave. You have some fun. But it's short-lived. But it's very, uh, it's very like, uh, crazy and intense. It's a rush of emotions. And that's exactly what XDC is going to bring, but not for a night. XDC is going to bring the ecstasy for life. <laughs> Generationally, your kid's kid is going to feel the ecstasy from XDC. The UK's most established trade and expert finance conference is coming up in London. Okay, why is this relevant? It's coming up. And uh, if you look up GTR Global Trade Finance, oops. it's uh, partnered actually over here with uh, one of XDC's main partners, uh, ITR. XDC is really busy right now because they're also going to be at this event, September 28th to the 30th. They're also going to be at this event. This is an event regarding XDC, the WTO Public Forum on, on uh, Trade Beyond the Germ. There are going to be a, a bunch of different events coming up. So they're going to be having a lot of uh, basically advertising to all these, like October 6th to 8th, the annual International Trade Conference is happening. And this is basically uh, XDC. So they have a lot of stuff happening. What is XCC in one sentence? The XCC network is a scalable blockchain technology solution which supports a variety of use, case, use cases including trade, finance, asset dis distribution, tokenization, international payments, non-fungible asset creation, decentralized email, and decentralized storage. XDC is going after uh, trade, uh, like lending, borrowing, trade finance, and uh, it's not a small market. It's an enterprise blockchain, and basically it's a $7.6 trillion market. There's only 12 billion XDC coins that will ever exist. You do the math. $7 trillion market, 12 billion coins that exist, and you could get XDC at $0.13 cents right now. That's why it's going to bring the XDC it's gonna bring the ecstasy in your whole entire family tree. It's gonna allow, set a lot of people up. It is ISO 20022 friendly. It already has a certification. It's one of the most hybrid, uh, green friendly cryptos out. XTC is gonna be massive. I haven't done a video on it in a while, but I wanted to remind you guys, it brings the ecstasy. I wanted to explain that whole, uh, the meaning of that little saying that I always say. So what, what we're seeing right now is the tip of the iceberg. We see the surface level. We see what's happening. But imagine what's all happening behind closed doors. They have to put some out into the public. But imagine all the stuff that's happening behind the closed doors. And we can kind of see it. With all the decoding we do here and everything that we do in these channels, we see the full picture. We know what's coming in the next 10 years. And we have the, the patience to go and know that we're planting these seeds for the long term and in the long term these things are going to be massive massive oak trees and yeah we're going to see some massive gain in the short term i believe xdc will be at 77 cents by the end of this year and that's a massive gain that's insane gains in, in, in a typical sense however with these utility tokens these utility coins we really don't know how how serious like these gains xcc could go to 416 dollars a coin i've read 416 dollars a coin 
buying at 13 cents. You serious? None of this is financial advice. I'm just sharing different things. And XRP is not a security. XRP is not a security. Gary Gensler wants to be our daddy and wants to tell us and protect us. And what the hell are you going to protect us from, Gary? Think about it. Ever grow ever however the hell you say ever gande whatever it's funny that the logo is literally a q the logo for that shit is a q i mean if you guys are still doubting come on but that's all we already know that this is the black swan that we've been talking about for years everybody's talking about the black swan and we said it first we people that follow mr pull knew from the knew for a year a whole year now that the black swan was coming we've been preparing for it we're ready and we're gonna seize this opportunity. We're gonna ride the wave. And we already know when that real estate collapses in China, it's gonna be a domino effect. They have to have a new system. We are invested in the new system. We are good. We are, we are invested in the new system. The banks are screwed. You know, with ultra stellar, you could get 9% yield with your YSD, U, uh, YUSDC 9%. Why would people hold money in a bank after learning about that? And it's more secure. Banks can get hacked. So banks are in trouble. The people are getting stronger and more powerful. We're rising up like the Phoenix. The economists even know. They know right after this is all done, the Phoenix rises. So we are going to go through a bumpy road. But at the end of it, the Phoenix rises. Everybody have a great day. Peace.